So, ever wondered what the lump with a small black hole in the center is? You could possibly have something called as a sebaceous cyst. Now, what is a sebaceous cyst? A sebaceous cyst is a small round lump that develops under your skin. It is caused by blockage in the sebaceous glands which produces mainly oil. The blockage causes the glands to swell and fill up with sebum, a yellowish cheesy material. Sebaceous cysts are most commonly seen on the face, scalp, neck and back. Now, what are the common symptoms of sebaceous cysts? A small round lump under the skin, a lump that may be skin colored or sometimes whitish or yellowish. The lump is usually painless, but it may become tender or painful when it becomes infected. If the cyst ruptures, a yellowish cheesy material or waxy material may drain out of it that is pretty bad smelling. Now, what are the causes of sebaceous cyst? Mainly hormonal changes, puberty, pregnancy, menopause and all these can influence the sebum secretion and sebaceous cyst gland activity. Any injury, a bump or a scrape can cause damage of the glands and lead to blockage. An infection, generally bacterial, can lead to the, again, a blockage and inflammation. Now, how do we treat a sebaceous cyst? Most of the small sebaceous cysts do not require treatment and generally they may drain away. But if a cyst has persisted and stayed on for a very long time, it's better you meet a surgeon and get it sorted with. However, if the cyst is bothersome and becomes infected, a doctor must drain it or must remove it. Now, when the cyst is infected, it becomes bulging with yellowish content of pus. The doctor may offer you a solution where we drain the abscess. We give local anesthesia into that area and then we make a small nick and we will drain the pus out, okay? But this is not a permanent fixture. Normally, sebaceous cysts should be excised in the operation theater under local anesthesia where we remove the complete cyst in toto so that the recurrence doesn't happen. Small sebaceous cysts are normally done as an OPD procedure where you do it in the OPD after giving a small dose of local anesthesia and then we remove the cyst in toto and put some sutures. But if it, you have multiple cysts or a very large cyst, local anesthesia will not work and for this you will have to get admitted in the hospital and get the cyst removed. Now coming to how to prevent sebaceous cyst. There is no sure way to prevent sebaceous cyst, but there are some things you can do to reduce the risk. Keep your skin clean and moisturized. Avoid picking and squeezing your skin. Wear a sunscreen to protect your skin from sun, probably using some sort of a salicylic acid body wash, especially if you have back sebaceous cyst, will help in a long term process. I hope this video about sebaceous cyst was useful and educative. You can reach out to me. If you like uh, the video, please share and subscribe with your friends. Thank you.